These dogs seem calm now, but earlier today, they were loose on the streets, attacking dogs and people alike. They were pretty bad this morning. It, they were relentless. J.R. Heim says he witnessed the brutality out his window. It was pretty scary. J.R. says that a couple were walking their small dog around here, Adams Boulevard and Storch. That's when all of a sudden these dogs appeared and they started to attack. The dogs were just kind of surrounding this area over here and they'd run across the street and they'd come back and just attack like they would attack from different sides. We're really concerned about the puppy because we heard that he was injured quite badly and taken um, to emergency vet. Michelle Sawyer, the interim director of Saginaw County yeah. Animal yeah. Control, says when she heard the attack on Adams, she dispatched her officers. By then, the dogs were attacking another dog on Brockway. Eventually, officers caught these dogs after a third sighting. It makes me feel really good that they're, that they're off the street. The dogs didn't have collars and were not microchipped, according to Sawyer. She says their behavior could have been caused by a pack mentality. Dogs wanting loose will often act in ways that they would not normally act, sometimes just out of fear or sometimes just, you know, out of that wild instinct, especially when they're running together. The future of these dogs is a little bit up in the air right now. They're in a 10-day quarantine. They're being tested, and they're going to see if these are aggressive dogs. If they are, they'll be put down. Reporting in Saginaw County, Scott Walchek, WNEM TV5.